planning to repipe your house, watch this video and I'm gonna mitigate all your learning curve in less than 10 minutes. Planning to repipe your house, you can do either copper lines or PEX lines. Everyone these days are going towards PEX line because they are more scientifically more uh, advanced. It's got a lot of advantages over it versus uh, the copper lines. I'm going to talk about all the advantages you have when you do PEX versus copper. And also I'm going to talk about the disadvantages you have. And in the last segment, I'm going to talk about which companies are, which brands uh, you should be looking at. Let's talk about all the advantages you have when you do a PEX line. The first one actually is that it is cheaper than copper. So if you do uh, PEX, it is way cheaper than copper line. You can get a quote from a, a copper a plumbing company versus a PEX and you will see that copper is little more expensive than the PEX line. Number two, it's more robust. You know, when you install it, you know that, you know, it's not gonna get started. You know, the, the, the product, you know, you're gonna use, you know, it would be more robust and all the connection and connectors, they work really good. Versus when you are using a, a copper lines, there are a lot of fittings they use there. A lot of times they have to solder them, do all that stuff, yeah? So it doesn't sound as if, you know, the job is done. Sometimes there could be a human, human error and stuff like that, yeah? So P, uh, PEX is much more robust than uh, the copper line, in my opinion. Number thir third is that it has got less destruction in your house. Let's say you own your house and you already want, you already have copper lines in your house. When you want to repipe the lines, the old lines are abandoned in the house, irrespective whether you use PEX or copper. However, when you're using a copper line, there is more destruction because copper is not as flexible when you want to put the lines inside. So they have to make more holes in, in, those, uh, in your uh, drywall. So when you are using a PEX, uh, then there's less less destruction on your wall uh, drywall and less labor actually in you know in the end basically when you're patching the walls and stuff. So there's less uh, destruction in your house. It's gonna help you and chips uh, save money on the labor also. And fourth very important thing is that uh, you know there's no oxidation when it comes to PEX versus a PV uh, a copper line would have oxidation over the time and basically that means there would be no paint hole leaks anymore. The last one obviously is peace of mind. Once you have PEX, I have houses where it's been like 10 years and we have no leaks whatsoever, you know, and we never had any problem. So I really, really like uh, doing PEX. What is the disadvantage of PEX? PEX, uh, PEX pipes have actually, you know, it's kind of plastic, kind of PVC, little different in design, uh, in, in the chemical uh, functionality, for, you know, when they uh, manufacture, you know, it's little different. So basically it is not UV protected. Meaning that if you have a situation where the line would somehow be uh, exposed to sun, then over the time it will become brittle. Most of the PEX lines would be inside the house, but I've seen they have to cross something and then, you know, then in that situation you have to figure out how to use a PEX line. There are ways to do it. You can actually do a metal casing on them and stuff like that. So there are ways you can do, insulate them uh, accordingly and then do a metal casing on top. And the second disadvantage is the rodents. If you have a house which was built prior to 1960, essentially if you have a house which has got raised foundation or a situation where the pest can or the rodents can get in and your PEX lines are there, then there's a good chance that they can chew it. So that would be a big disadvantage. So you have to be careful. That's why you want to make sure that you hire a right plumber and so that the right thing is done in your house and right uh, plumbing design is done right, yeah? So now, which company you should choose?